Hey, welcome back to the channel. Um, it's been requested uh, by a number of you easy walkers out there. Um, what size of a walk can I use on this uh, X72 burner system? Um, so today I've gathered up all my walks from a 12 inch up to a 24 inch walk. And I'm going to show you how they fit on the iron bowl and what are some of the safety things I want to look at when I'm using a different size walk. This one is a 12 inch, 11.8 inches to be exact. And I picked it up because, you know, it's one of those little novelty things I thought it might be kind of cool to have. What I did discover though, and I want to show you this, is how it sits on the iron bowl. I'm just going to spin this iron bowl like this. I'm going to set this walk down. And you can see this big gap here. Well, the deflection of the flames off the bottom of the walk will come up and hit this part of the handle. And that can be a situation where the walk handle ends up getting hot. I can't show you a walk without a story why I have the walk. So I'll just tell you, see if I can get away with a quick story. So I was, I was on a TV show up in San Francisco and we were shooting an exterior and right across the street, I noticed the walk shop. So at lunchtime, I went in there. I don't remember the gal's name, but God bless her. They, they had, it's like a candy store for me. So I went in there, they had these, cast iron walks so I decided to get a couple it works very well on this iron bowl there isn't much of a gap here at all so a shallow walk on this iron bowl is going to work fantastic or a 14 inch or bigger the 12 inch is where you had that issue here's the 14 inch cast iron walk and that also fits really good. There's hardly a gap here too. So we also have the 14 inch carbon steel walk, shallow, also fits on this iron bowl beautifully with not leaving a big gap here where the, uh, the shield is. And now we'll go right from this 14 inch carbon steel walk to the one that we sell with the complete kit, which is the 14 inch handheld carbon steel walk. Now, the thing about this one is that down the road while you're cooking and you get oil on the back of this walk or you get oil somewhere along these fins here, this slight bit of weight with this handle may cause this walk to tilt down. Don't be alarmed, it's, it's just the nature of this handheld walk. Then I'll go to the 16, right? And this one fits on here perfect too. You can see the, the shield, lots of protection there. And in this walk, you know, you gotta have a strong forearm to do the tossing with a bunch of food in there. I would use this big walk if I were doing, uh, let's say a bunch of fried chicken, chicken wings, you know, some fried foods and or stir fried noodles, a big batch of if I'm cooking for a lot of people. And then the last one I have here is the big 24. This is for big events, but it works fine. The one thing that I haven't tested is that with the Easy Walk cart, we have a hole cut in here on the top shelf and this iron bowl fits in to the hole. This stainless steel gauge is about a 19 gauge. So it's not really thick and heavy stainless steel. So I'm not sure about how much weight uh, the thin stainless steel will support. You know, 30 pounds of food that's being supported on that, that hole that's hanging on the lip of this thing. So if I were doing this and, and putting a bunch of, uh, say, frying oil or something like that, I might take my burner out and put it on a nice heavy duty table. Thanks for checking in. I hope that answered your questions and we'll see you on the next video.